And um, I think my water broke. First time leaving Arizona, I'm trying to relax and like not be emotional. We'll come into the emergency today to have it checked. I actually put it on a oops, put it on a ziplock bag, um, so that they will check it and like see to it if it's my amniotic fluid that's leaking. I'm trying to be positive as much as possible i was just finishing packing my um toiletries and like last minute stuff i have to put them on the hospital bag i've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain some things are not the same as they were a year ago but all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I don't have any contractions and I don't feel any pain For now um, and it's not the same for every woman to like, guarantee that if the amniotic, like if your fluid leaks, it would speed up labor. So it's not the same for every everyone. Um, I've heard other stories that once their water broke, they immediately feel the contractions. and. like by the pain but i don't feel anything right now thankfully we're so thankful we have friends that we can count on um i actually called them already and they will come in here to watch paula as we like find things out chance that I will be induced today and um, if 
they do that, um, they will not let me eat anything before the procedure. So might as well get some food to eat for, for both me and Jofo. Um, I did get the French vanilla, small French vanilla and farmer's wrap and a bagel. So that should be enough. I'm in triage now and they confirmed that it was really my amniotic fluid that was leaking and so I will be admitted for today they were just waiting on like the team to see me at around 6 30 I am now on my disposable and these It's now 7.16 a.m. I don't know if you can see that, but they put this like thing on me so it's easier to like hook up the IV later. We are already in the delivery room. It's pretty huge. That's the entrance and then that's the nurse's corner. Like this is my bed. I'm already in the hospital gown. Um, you can actually wear your own hospital gown. That's the chairs for the visitors right there. But I don't think we're allowed to accept visitors. Hi. Right. That's the bathroom right there. Inside there's a tub where I can... Let me show you. There's a jacuzzi actually where I can do like the rest. Ooh. Where I can do the rest of my labor. There's the mirror. Then the toilet. And this is like the baby area right here where they will put baby in here. They put blue because I'm expecting a boy. That's the view outside of our room their delivery room are they're so huge I think I'm gonna do my makeup mm -hmm. I'm just gonna do a light makeup mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. already hooked me up to 
the pitocin. So pitocin is like a synthetic form of the oxytocin hormone which will help um, speed up labor. They increase it to a six. So it started with like two and then four and then now it's six. And I don't have any major strong painful contractions yet. It's just like period like cramps on my lower abdomen and on my lower back. So let's see. I already tried the birthing ball but I'm gonna try a different position right now. So I'm standing up and like swing. Hi, it's now ten thirty. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah,
Thank you. Thank you guys. 